Hey folks, welcome to ADSR. I'm Stephen Ellistad. Make sure you subscribe to ADSR YouTube channel and follow on social media. So in this tutorial, I wanted to show you a really cool, really specialized, really nice uh, plugin from Waves Factory. It's a contact instrument that runs in the full version of contact and it's called suspended symbols. Rather than trying to create instruments that do everything for, for all kinds of situations, Waves Factory has really kind of focused on creating very specific, very useful and organic sounding samples of a number of different things. They have a bunch of different uh, things from ukuleles to um, cymbals, drum circles, the shaker instrument Shireen, which I actually reviewed a while back. And this is in that same vein. And I think this is actually one of the most useful of them because one of the things we often don't have is some really nice natural cymbal tones as accent points in our productions, especially if we're working in a more electronic vein. So what this is, is just, we have five cymbals, and then we have for each of those a different a particular key equates to a different strike on the cymbal itself. We have a roll that we can control with the modulation wheel, and we have a damping key. The cymbals themselves start with a uh, Zildjian Custom Session Crash 16 inch. There's a Zildjian Avedis Custom 18 here. A Zildjian Dark Medium Thin 18 inch K series. Pasty Masters Dark Crash. And an Istanbul Mehmet Traditional 18. And they all have a very different character. This lets us have some really natural cymbal tones that are very playable, uh, especially the rolls on every single instrument if we just hit, at, hit the F key. Our modulation wheel lets us control the intensity, so we can just let these rolls happen. You can play a couple of them at once. And get some really cool sounds to just perform cymbal parts into your, um, into your productions. And so how it breaks down for every particular a key down here we have a sustained hit a side stick a bell hit that roll with the modulation wheel and you can just let off of the key at any time and it's really intuitive how to play that and then if we have something going, also a natural damper on the G key, it's marked in red. It's a round robin. Uh, there's four layers of sampling and a bunch of different velocity layers. And this trigger down here, just record that into your session if you want to make sure that your round robins all start from the exact same point every time you play. But we can come over here, we have a mixer. It lets us actually choose to use only close mics, far mics, or uh, mid mics. Um, we can adjust panning and width of the medium and far mics and balance those together. So we can really go for a really dry tone. Or we can really kind of go the opposite direction and really focus on more of an ambient sound. For sound design or just big particular impacts, you know, we might want to go with something with more ambience. And as far as the reverbs go, we've got a ton of different uh, impulse responses from halls and plates as well as a couple of rooms here so we can really find a, a something that really suits the tone and the sound that we're going for uh, and there's the size we can adjust the envelope and the EQ as well at that point for the reverb over here we can adjust the round robin from uh, one time to four times uh, and the velocity curve if we want to adjust that uh, to more sensitivity or a little less sensitive and even the muffling time if we want that muffle to take a little bit to be a little quicker or instead a much more gradual muffle we can adjust our dynamic range and then we can look at sustain side bell roll 
the roll release, and the effects levels. And so the effects themselves are different, you know, effects on that particular symbol. So it sounds like some, some brushes being swept across. Just definitely some, some different character kind of parts. Yeah, I think there's a lot to like here. This is a really useful tool. It's not trying to be everything to everybody. It's just trying to give you a lot of control when you're looking at a couple of different symbols and some really nice articulations to play them on your track. So this is Suspended Symbols by Waves Factory. They have a lot of these specialized instruments. They're very affordable, and they really sound great. I'm Stephen Ellis for ADSR. Thanks for checking this out, and make sure you subscribe to the ADSR YouTube channel and follow on social media. We'll see you next time. Take care.